Yeah, absolutely. And you have to, like I say, Georgia, I think were a little lucky. They had poor discipline, but unfortunately, the Portuguese number nine, who was taking the kicks at the time, didn't have the best success rate. And they could have punished them a lot more. So, like I say, Georgia are a bit lucky there. So I think they're out to prove a point in this competition now. Well, Spain were unlucky, but have they got through here? Brad Linklater is the man that seems to have benefited from that ricochet. Now, they're going to have to look back at this because, where was it? That was a lovely little pass inside from Pierre Barter. Time being up in the first half. But in the second, Romania looking for the try and conversion that might win them the game. They get the try. Huge celebration from Romania. The ball is down and over the line. It's finished after. And what a romantic day yeah. yeah. this could be. Incredible to put the money to pass the thousand points. This game can have the chance to steal it at the very end. I mean, incredible effort from this big man up front. Stay. But they've had no right to get back in this game. Or loose once more, but now it's in the hands of Suza Getch. We're going to try and step his way through the middle. Portugal love the opportunity to keep it loose through the hands they go through the skipper Appleton have they got room wide out on the outside oh it's going to be Rafael Squatti who docks down look at the celebrations for Portugal they know what that might do psychologically to Romania and they're looking to make history in Lisbon this afternoon and it's that transitional pay again round the corner Fast players against the bigger defenders on the inside. Missed tackle on the outside arm. Merci, As he jumps into his players. The one to watch. This just gives a reason why. Kuda Vordor is trying to slow things down, but now it's with Vortella, and now they're trying to open them up here. Ball back inside from Marta. It's brilliant support play, and the finish will come from the fly half. Jeronim Portella with Portugal's second try. And it's another beauty. The ball in behind, and then that support line again from Marquesh on the inside, as all good nines do. They track the ball, and his fellow halfback alongside him, Portella, gets the rewards. Some amazing running going on from the captain, Charakadze. Charakadze feeds out to Tabatate and he's got over. But there'll be question marks about whether there was any blocking going on in that midfield. Surely, Philip, what was your take on that? Well, it's definitely one I think we're going to have to go back and look at. But talk about making something out of nothing, which is where maybe you would question, is there any blocking? Because it just seemed to open up right in front of him. Great footwork. Good awareness to know where the support player was. 